Hello Internet, I am Arzazim, welcome to my channel. Today in Let's Play, I will be playing Minecraft. Uh, I just heard about this game like a month ago. I know it's hard to believe, but it's the truth. I never knew about the game. I, I heard there's a game with blocks in it. So, Minecraft. I never played it. And people say that 92% of gamers in this world had played this game. So unfortunately I come in the other 8%. Well, not today cuz I'm going to play this Minecraft. I think so it's episode 1. So without any delay, let's get to the game. But before, oh, it's getting hot. I think I should get rid of my shirt. A few moments later, their greatest quest would take them on a dangerous journey to fight a mysterious creature known as the Ender Dragon. In the end, the Order of the Stone emerged victorious, and the dragon was defeated. Their story complete, they slipped away into the pages of legend. But when one story ends, another one begins. Would you rather fight a hundred chicken-sized zombies or ten zombie-sized chickens? Yeah. Just to be clear, you wouldn't have any weapons or armor, so you'd have to fight them with your hands. Huh? Huh? What? <laughs> it's just a dumb question. Forget it. So, I've got a daylight sensor on the roof. Mm -hmm. And if I did this right, these lamps should turn on once it gets dark. Mm -hmm. I didn't want to just leave Reuben here with nothing while we're at the building competition. He's coming with us. Really? What? What kind of question is that? Of course he okay, is. Okay, I'm not saying he shouldn't come. I'm not. But don't you think it's a little weird that you take him with you everywhere you go? He kind of makes us look like... I don't know. Amateurs. It's not weird at all. Reuben is the best pet I could ask for. Obedient, loyal... And always happy to see me at the end of a long day. No friend. I should have said friend, not pet. I didn't mean anything by it. I'm glad he's coming. I just don't want to give people one more reason to call us losers. That... Oh, no. Boom! <laughs> You guys totally freaked out. That was on. Axel, what's the matter with you? Great. Now I'm gonna smell like a pig in Endercon. I thought we were buddies. That wasn't funny, Axel. I brought you good times and now I'm being punished for you it. You scared us half to death. Did you bring the fireworks? Yeah, kind of. of course I did. I even brought something for the little guy. Nice. You brought Reuben a disguise? Um, we're going to a convention. Somebody's got to wear a costume. He looks awesome. It only took me like a million hours to build it. All right, all right. This head choice is okay. What's the control? WASD. Use the mouse to look around. Okay. Gabriel the Warrior. Oh, okay, you think we'll ever get that famous? It's not impossible. Maybe I'll get famous for my sweet poster collection. Maybe I will get famous by my YouTube videos. Shears definitely taking these. Never know when I might need to shear some sheep. <laughs> One of these days, we're gonna win the Endercon building competition. And when we do, people will look at us and say, hey, there goes Jesse and Ruben, winners of the Endercon building competition. They really should change the name. Wait a minute, we're thinking about this all wrong. The point of the building competition isn't just to build something. We have to do something to get noticed by the judges. Okay then, so how do we do this? We don't just build something functional, we build something fun. After we finish the fireworks machine like we planned, then we build something cool on top of it. You might be onto something. If we want to get a reaction out of the judges, you build something scary. So I say we build a creeper. Wouldn't an Enderman be better? I'm more scared of Endermen than creepers. They both have their what moments. Are they both pretty scary. Then again, you scared the crap out of us with a creeper today. Let's build a zombie. 
guess that's kind of like a creeper. Eh, it's a monster. It's fine. We are so ready. Yeah. yeah. I think this is the first time we've decided on something before getting to the competition. Think we've got everything we need? It wouldn't hurt to grab a little more. Let's get to grabbing then. We're so prepared. We can't lose. And not. Bring it in. <laughs> Dare to prepare on three. No, 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 no. Preparing is daring. No, that's that's the same thing. Forget it. Uh, team on three. One, two, three. Team! team. Prepare. Oh. Team attack. I have heard that you game. Ah, oh. ये गेम टेक्टिक्स के बाद नंबर सेकंड पोजीशन पे सबसे ज्यादा सबसे ज्यादा बिकना लाइक 92 परसेंट पीपल हैव प्लेड दिस गेम आई वाज इन द 8 परसेंट जिन्होंने नहीं खेला गेम So much for losing anonymously. We're the Dead Enders. Whoa, sounds like a name for pirates. Dead it's enders. cool. Okay, Dead Enders, you guys are in booth five. Ah! Ah! <laughs> okay. Okay, gentlemen. This is just. Hmm. Nope. Nothing. Can't lose. Say what? Let's do it. Building starts now. Oh no! A fireworks dispenser. I'm so scared. You worry about your build, <laughs> we'll worry about ours. Well, the competition is not that bad. This looks so cool. We'll win this for sure. How could anyone not love the zombie? Because Good I'm call, Jesse. Is playing this game. Guys, people are looking at us. Good build, man. What? No way. It's just a bunch of dyed wool. Whoops. Oh no, Ruben's on fire! The lava's getting closer. Gonna ruin the bill. Ruben's going to get lost. We've got to do something. But our build is about to go up in flames. You guys stay and save the build. On it. We've got to cover, Jesse. Be careful. <laughs> we'll meet up with you at Endercon. Hmm. Pig tracks. Ruben, I don't want to be out here in the dark. I choose my decision more. I mean, this game has a lot of different decisions. What are they doing? These definitely belong to a pig. Hmm. No way, Ruben made these on his own. Oh, that's kind of weird. 
Hey Ruben, I got a carrot for you. Where are you, buddy? Get it home, Murdo. Ruben, are you in there? That's how it fits. Ruben! No, not you guys. Pigs! Hey, all pigs but Ruben, shut up! Jump scared there. Ruben. Ruben. Oh no, you in there, buddy? Oh. oh geez, please don't be toasted, Ruben. YouTubers ने भी ये गेम खेला हुआ है लेकिन अलग आई एम अफ्रेड मैंने कभी भी गेम नहीं खेला पता नहीं क्यों मतलब मुझे नहीं पता गेम कितना इतनी जल्दी इतनी फेम हासिल कर लेगा और लाइक इट्स जस्ट बॉक्सेस अभी गेम बिल्डिंग से ज्यादा हॉर फाइड होते जा रहा है मैं मुझे फास्ट क्लिक करेंगे तो शायद सही हो जाए Finally. Ruben, there you are. Hey, buddy, you want a carrot? Oh, I'm so happy to see you. I think, I think we're good. I think we made it. I saw these guys in that video. What's your video? Oh, you want it? Stay behind me. I've got you. I know it's bad. I'll think of something. You're gonna have to make a run for it, okay? I'll meet you back in town, I promise! Get out of here now! Come on, let's get out of the open. 
Thank you. I want to show you something. Not that this isn't a really cool, dimly lit tunnel, but how far away is this thing you want to show me? Careful, Jesse. You don't want to get a reputation as a wimp. Y this isn't my first time in a cave, Petra. <laughs> yeah, but have you ever seen a wither skull? Whoa! Fresh yeah. from the nether. You're the first person I've showed it to. So, you'd better appreciate this. You risked your life for that dusty old skull? Oh, I risk my life for the thing I'm gonna exchange for that dusty old skull. There's this guy I'm meeting That's up with at Endercon. What? He's gonna trade me a diamond for it. Okay, I... Being the resident go-getter pays off every once in a while. Literally. Is a wither skull worth that much? <laughs> Are you kidding? For all the trouble I had to go to get it, I should be asking for much more. Yeah. Wow. Wow, what? In a single day, you went to the nether, you killed a wither skeleton. I mean, I did build a super cool statue, but still, it's pretty sweet being you, huh? You know, you could come with me. I mean, if you're too nervous, I totally get it. But I wouldn't mind a little backup. I'd be honored to be your backup. Don't have to make such a big deal out of it. What Endercon was like before it was cool? Remember what we were like before we were cool? Some of us will never be cool. Ha ha. <laughs> Creepers! <sighs> Crap! <laughs> ah! This doesn't look good. Well, there's only one way off this bridge. So, Whatever we do, we do it together. The only way off this bridge is through them. into the water. You don't land on top of it. Pull yourself together and follow me. Essie. And Petra? Hey, you all know Petra, my new super close friend. We're super close now. We ran into each other while I was looking for Reuben. Couldn't find him, huh? He'll turn up sooner or later. I just know it. I saw him, but before I knew what was happening, we were under attack by a zombie horde. I told him to run. It was for his own good. What were you doing in the woods, Petra? Nothing. Just drawn by the sound of Jesse's high-pitched screams. I would have been spider-bait if she hadn't found me. Sorry we didn't come with you, Jesse. But hey, we won! Looks like abandoning friends and their time of need paid off yet again. You guys built one hell of a zombie. We did okay, didn't we? I still wish I'd gotten that part in the back to look better. Could have fit more fireworks in there, somewhere. I'm proud of you guys. Ah, oh, shucks. Don't make me blush. Seriously, don't. Hey, Jesse, it's time to go see about that thing. Oh, right, the thing. Subtle. Yeah? As a punch to the f Stay here, just in case this is the spot he meant, and I'll look around. I guess I could have heard him wrong. Then again, I've never gotten a meetup spot wrong before. Okay, I'll hold down the fort. Thanks, Jesse. I'll be back before you know it. If he shows up while I'm gone, just stall for me. Oh, 
box. <clears throat> and just who are you? Who's this guy? I'm waiting. No, who are you? If you belonged here, you would know. Unless that's all part of the plan? I'm supposed to meet with Petra, not whatever you're supposed to be. Give me one good reason why I shouldn't walk out of here right now. Okay. Well, I'm a very busy man. I'm with Petra. My deal is with her, not her partner. She'll be here, but we can get started without her. Do you have the skull? Uh, well... You do or you don't? You'd better not be toying with me. Uh, of course I have it. What kind of dealer would I be if I didn't? Let's see it, then. You want to see it? You bet I want to see it. I'm going to show you. Show me, then. Stop rushing me. I get nervous when I'm rushed. I'm not wasting any more time with you. Ivor! Not a moment too soon. Your partner here almost soured the deal. Ah, oh, well, that's not good. I left my friend Jesse here while I went looking for you. I'll take that diamond now. Take it. You've earned it. Uh, this isn't a diamond. No, it's lapis. Of all the dirty, underhanded tricks to pull. I can't believe that guy got one over on me. I knew we couldn't trust that guy. Screw this. We're going after him. I'm either getting that diamond, or I'm getting my skull back. Yeah, or you'll make him pay, right? Right? Come on. Do you see him anywhere? Mm, no. We lost him. Then we'll just have to find him again. Go. Okay. Okay, Julia. I thought he had me. Well, we won't find him just standing around. There he is! Gabriel! Gabriel! Step aside, please! I have just one question! Hold all your questions until after the keynote. But the keynote sold out! Hold all your questions anyway. You guys big Gabriel fans or something? Too bad it's sold out. So? I got I sold out. I got a bad guy. He was also a bad guy. <laughs> Thought you could just wiggle right out of that trap, didn't you? Well, wiggle as much as you want. You're not going anywhere. Axel, listen up. Any chance you've seen a creepy looking beardy guy anywhere? No. Petra told me what happened. I'm keeping an eye out for him. <laughs> okay, so I got a little distracted. It's just this machine presses all my buttons. Unnecessarily complicated and mean to birds for no reason. It's just, when something like this calls, you gotta answer. But I swear, as soon as the demonstration is over, we really need your help, Axel. If we don't find this guy soon, we might never find him. I was looking, I just got distracted. Whoa. Have you seen Reuben? I was hoping he might have made it to town while I was distracted. I haven't seen hide nor hair. But I'm sure he's he fine. Like he's he's a tough he's little ham. Axel? All right, all right, I'll look. After I watch one more chicken get owned. Ha, <laughs> I see you now, weirdo. Well, if it isn't Team Trash Bag, that was your stupid pig. I hear intense heat causes brain damage. Kind of busy right now, man. What, busy trying to get a life? I'm busy trying to find some friends. Hey! Maybe it was a point you Hey, what do you think you're- What do you think you're doing? Oh, I'm sorry. Get away from me! I said I was sorry. 
quite hard maybe you can tell me no features of the Ruben? Is that you? Get your pork chops here. Fresh off the bow. Don't tell me Ruben's here. Nothing sticks to your ribs quite like a juicy pork chop. Ruben! What's the big idea? I'm trying to run a business here. That's my pig! Oh, really? Well, I found him out in the woods, so I think that makes him my pig. Not the fattest pig I've ever seen. Well, he should cook up real nice anyway. Please, he's my friend! To me, he's inventory. I might be amenable to some kind of trade. Not that you look like you've got much of value. <laughs> I gotta get some kind of return on my investment. Give me back my pig. All right, you little maniac. Fine. Take him. He's yours. Come on, Reuben. I'm sorry, Reuben. I never should have let you run off in the woods. Looks like he's heading towards the hall. We're gonna have to get past that usher to follow him. Let's go! So, yeah, hey. What would it take to get us inside tonight? Uh, tickets? <laughs> <laughs> that was a good one. You should laugh. This might sound crazy, but we're actually on an important mission. I hope your mission came with tickets to the show, because, I mean, otherwise... Chicken! 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 Oh! It's gone. You're totally fine. You were totally cool, dude. We have to do something. Like what? This show has been sold out for ages. I could bust right through. I just need a little wind-up room. Any other bright ideas? We need a distraction. A lot of chickens running around might be a distraction. Shoo, shoo! Get out of here! Usher is afraid of chickens. What would you say if I told you I want to break this guy's chicken machine to create the mother of all distractions? But you have to break that pane of glass. How are you going to reach it? Let's look around. There has to be something we can do. Okay. I need to reach that window, but the fence is in the way. But I don't think I can mess up the fence if he's around. Okay. Oh, hmm. I bet I could reach that glass with a slime block. Oh, hey, we meet again. <laughs> hey. One slime block, please. We don't give out slime blocks here, just slime balls. Mama. We've got a limited supply today, and we're only giving out two mm -hmm. per customer. You could craft your own slime block if you had nine slime balls. I'm really sorry about earlier. I honestly thought you were someone else. Apology accepted. A round of slime balls for everyone, please. Wait, this is only eight slime balls. We need one more to make a block. Okay, we need to find another way to get some more slime, and quick. On it. Hey, uh, Lucas, can you do me a favor? Anything's possible. I need slime balls. I swear I have a really good explanation. Whatever you guys are doing, count me in. Thanks, Lucas. Told you he was useful. Aw, oh, man. This guy isn't actually cool, is he? Remains to be seen. It's crafting time. Okay. So, you guys been building together long? You've got good chemistry. Are you jealous? I'm just saying. I think it's cool you have a team that works so well together. You're totally jealous. How's it going, Jesse? You know how to do this. A slime in every slot, and uh, every slot, a slime. Oh, 
Ta-da! One slime block. Gross. I'll take that. Right there. It's all you, Jesse. Give me a boost. Yeah. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Ah! No! I, I missed that. My poultry! My precious poultry! Keep your eyes closed, they will pack out your eyes! Now's our chance. Hey! What do you think we're doing, Adi? Where'd he go? Definitely there. The Through that door. What do we do once we catch him? There are a million ways to play this. But considering this isn't my fight, I'll follow your lead. I wouldn't mind a little payback. He deserves it for crossing Petra. You ready? Ready. So you see anything? He must have gone out another way. What is all this? Looks like it used to be the basement. Weird place to have a hideout. I bet you anything I'll find my wither skull here. And if we find anything else cool to steal along the way, so <laughs> be it, right? Yep. Axel, that's not what we're here to do. I did say we wanted payback. No better payback than thieving from a thief, right? <laughs> I don't want to stoop to his level. But isn't that the best way to get back at him? We should have... Ivor could come back any minute. There's no time for looting. There's always time for looting, Jesse. Always. The faster we find what we're looking for, the faster we can get the heck out of here. Okay. Focus. Mostly stuff about brewing. Too heavy. And too soft. But super flashy. Yeah, I don't think this guy does much fighting. Hey, you still have that one stone sword, right? Yeah, I had to wave it at this jerkwad butcher earlier, you know, to save Reuben's life. Impressive. You're keeping it? But I thought it was too soft, too heavy. Eh, it still might come in handy. And it is super flashy. Cut, cut, cut. I will cut this scene. I will cut this scene. Ooh, take a look at this. You're not going to believe me, but I swear I had a dream about this. Okay, Potion. I know this is a big step, but I would be honored if you'd come home with me. It's yours if you want it that bad. <laughs> I've never wanted anything badder. There's no way he won't notice his fancy potion is missing. A good thief always covers his tracks. <laughs> Fixed it. Oh, yeah, the perfect crime. <coughs> what the hell is all this stuff? Soul sand. It was everywhere in the nether. What about that block in the middle? I've never seen one of these before. I wonder if I just take a closer look. Do you feel that? It's almost pulsing. How is it glowing like that? Don't touch that, Olivia. I was just curious. Don't forget what we're here for. Find that skull. Yeah. So, good news, weird news. I found the skull, but... The hell? Why'd I risk my neck for that skull if he's got two of them already? He was in such a hurry to get it, too. There's gotta be something bigger going on here. Maybe, Maybe Ivor's some kind of collector, a trophy hunter. Or he could be collecting them to make a bunch of banners. I think I know what's going on here. Soul Sand 
plus three wither skulls. That's the recipe for a wither. But a wither? That's... One of the worst monsters there is. We came down here to find the skull. Well, we found it. Maybe we should just grab it and get out of here while we still can. Oh, damn it. It's back. Uh, guys? Scatter! <laughs> Don't you recognize me? Oh, wait. Surprised? To see me? No, that's not good. Thought you were rid of me, didn't you? That's better. What was that? Who's there? Over here, jerk! What are you doing here? What did you see? Leave him alone! Yeah, back off, pal. You two! Did you follow me here? You thought you could just screw us over and get away with it, didn't you? We're here to prove you wrong. What are you going to do about it? I have what I want, and you have exactly what you earned. Now get out before I put you out. Pay us what you owe us. You give us a diamond, we'll get out of your hair. I won't be threatened. Not by the likes of you. Hey, nobody talks to my friends like that. Now shut your mouth, or else. Enough! You've wasted too much of my time already. Where'd he go? If you won't leave of your own volition, <gasps> I'll happily remove you myself. Show our friends the door, will you? Okay. Um, guys? Where's Lucas? I thought he was right behind me. Well, if he's not here, the only place he could be is... He's still down there! Ivor's got an iron golem and all the ingredients to build a wither down there. If he were to unleash it in this crowd of people... We have to act fast. It just so happens that the greatest warrior of all time is in the building. We should ask Gabriel for help. This is the smartest way to help Lucas. He's tough. I just hope he's tough enough to hold out a little bit longer. We need Gabriel to get Lucas back and to deal with everything else we saw down there. We're doing the right thing, Jesse. I just hope Lucas can hold out against that golem long enough for us to get help. Come on, then. Let's crash this party. With the right training and guidance, anyone, and I mean anyone, can become a hero. You just have to believe it. We just gotta push through this crowd to get to Gabriel. Right there in the front row. You know, when uh, Elgard and the dragon, um, like, what was her favorite food? 
bread. Next question. Yes, next. What question do you have for the mighty Gabriel? Well? Our friend Lucas is in trouble. Is that so? Well, as you all know, trouble is what I do best. I'm not messing around. My friend is trapped with an iron golem. That does sound serious. I have a question for you. Excuse me, sir. You'll have to wait your turn. Just tell me first. Do you really believe anyone can be great? With enough hard work? Yes. Was that where I went wrong? I simply didn't work hard enough? Ivor? Is that really you? How dare you interrupt like this? That's the guy who attacked us in the basement. I wish I could say I was surprised. If it surprises you want, you're in for a treat. Why don't you tell them the real story, Gabriel? I see time has made you bitter. And it's made you an even bigger fool. Now these people were promised greatness, and I'm ready to deliver. I'm sorry this is how they had to learn the truth. Gabriel, you have to stop him! Nothing built can last forever, Gabriel. I will. No! Creature, attack! Looks like true greatness is out of his reach. He may not be able to defeat this creature, but I can! Creature! Retreat! <clears throat> creature! Retreat! Retreat, I said! Retreat! Ivor, what are you doing? Oh, no need to be alarmed, my friend. I have an elixir that will destroy this creature. That potion, is that? Uh-oh. Uh, what? Impossible. It should have worked. I took such care. The potion. Axel, you've got to throw the real potion. But finders keepers. You thieves, you're ruining everything. Axel, come on. Jesse, throw it! It's protecting itself! Without the command block exposed, the potion is useless! It wasn't supposed to happen like this! Ivor! You coward, come back here! Jesse, help me! Thank you. Ivor was right about one thing. I can't defeat that thing. Not on my own. Everyone's running away. Except for you. Will you help me? I must get to the temple. But what needs to happen next? I can't do alone. What are we waiting for? Lead on! This way! Chickens!
Wait! Wait, we have to stay together! Jesse, help me! I can't hold on! Do we still have everyone? We must set out for my fortress. We'll be better protected there. Thanks for that just now. Yeah, well, now we're even. The inner chamber is built entirely of obsidian. We should be untouchable in there. <laughs> Hurry! If you can get through the portal, you'll be safe! Uh, something's not right here. It's not lit! Everyone, get in! Now! Gabriel! Thank you. There are so many of them. I... I can't save them all. You cannot even save them yourself. I can't stop this by myself. We need to find the others. Others? Soren's been missing for years. But the others... You must seek them out. Take this amulet and guard it with your life. You can do this. How am I supposed to find Magnus and Eligard? The amulet will guide you. Take it through the portal, and then... You two, go through the portal and meet up with the others. I'll stay here and do whatever I can. Go on, Jesse, go! Get through that portal, now! I'm not leaving without you! The gang needs you, Jesse. Go through the portal. If anything happens, I'll meet you guys at the temple. Where are we? 
Where's Petra? We did everything we could. What are you saying? Jesse? What is he talking about? Because it doesn't sound... Why don't you tell them, Lucas? No. We just have to wait. Think about what you're walking into. No. There's nothing you can do. You'll just end up getting yourself killed. You don't know that. You don't know. Hey, there she is. Come on, come on. You again. Ivor, you ruined everything. Don't pretend you don't know, thief! You took my most valuable potion! <laughs> More needless violence. It solves nothing. Learn the lesson now or you'll share Gabriel's fate. There's nothing left up there! Nothing but that wither storm. Why are we wasting time talking to this jerk? We have to go and get Petra. The girl! I saw her. What? While I was running toward the portal, I passed her. She was running in the opposite direction. Such bravery. Of course, there's a fine line between bravery and stupidity. And your friend has crossed it. Our friend is in trouble because of you. We're trapped in the nether because of you. <laughs> you have much bigger problems to contend with. Through that tunnel is a network of minecarts built by the Order of the Stone. It's your only way out. We should go that way. Time's wasting. Let's go. What about you? What about me? How will you get out of here? Mm. I'll use my imagination. What? What was that? I would wish you good luck, but luck won't carry you through the nether. You have my sympathies. Let's get out of here! Run! This must be what Ivor was talking about. Everybody, hold on! Wow. The nether. Yeah, that is a lot of lava. And fire. And other things that could burn you to death. <laughs> oh no! Oh, that's a drop. That is very, very much a drop. Talking about new guy. What drop? Oh, crap. You weren't kidding. Here we go. seeing that we're running out of track, right? No! Good! Jesse! That switch! Now, do it! Oh, arms don't fail me now. Yeah <laughs> Wow! I thought something bad was gonna happen there, but <laughs> I guess everything's gonna be... Whoa! Jesse! Ah, no! Whoa! Wait! Oh, man! <laughs> uh, Axel? Olivia? Ruben? Anybody? Okay, Ruben, remember how I said everything was going to be just fine before? I know I was wrong then, but 
I have a very good feeling about it. Whoa! Well, Gaster officially crossed off my to see list. Done with gas. Never need to see them. Oh, crap. This is bad, this is bad, this is bad. Is, uh, is everyone okay? I mean, I'm not dead. I guess that's pretty good. Ditto. Ditto with the not dead. I just can't believe that Petra comes down here all the time. This place is awful. <laughs> Your throat's gonna be sore later, Axel. Why? You know how you have those experiences you remember and reminisce about for the rest of your lives? Yeah? This isn't one of those. Let's never discuss this ever again. Can you throw up, like, inside your body? Uh-huh. I know, because I just did. About five times. Wow. Look at this place. All these tracks converge at this point. You could probably get anywhere in the world from here. There's the portal. This is what Gabriel was talking about. Where are we? In the dark, in the middle of nowhere? Maybe we should bed down for the night. It's dangerous to be out when it's just dark. I thought we were headed toward a temple. We're looking for a giant building. It should be pretty obvious. Ivor said... No, Ivor said... Well, then maybe this is the temp. I'm being sarcastic. Axel, come on. We have to build a shelter. I thought that was what I said, but, uh... You're right. We should hurry. I say we build a treehouse. That'll take forever, and we'll be exposed while we do it. We just need a quick and dirty hut. Look, whatever it is, we gotta do it fast. What? In a hut, we won't know what's coming until it's knocking on our door. A treehouse is gonna be spider town. I hate spiders. Let's go with a treehouse. It's functional. It'll keep us out of danger. It's not a bad idea. All right, fine. Let's get started then. Spiders. If I wake up with a spider on my face, I'm gonna expect you to deal with it. Lower your expectations, Axel. Well, maybe if we'd built into the tree a little bit more, it could've... Never. It's... this is fine. It's good. Looks good, guys. Oh, man! What? I'm going to tell you something. You have to promise not to freak out. What is it? I have cookies. One for me. One for Olivia. One for Jesse. Thanks, Axel. And one for Reuben. <laughs> Sorry, Lucas. I only have four. Oh, no. It's... it's all right. I'm not that hungry anyway. Take it, Lucas. <laughs> no, no. I, I... I can't do that. I insist. Thank you, Jesse. 
That was for you, Jesse, not him. If you had to, which would you rather fight? A hundred chicken-sized zombies, or ten zombie-sized chickens? Choose wisely. <laughs> uh, that's a good one. Let me think. How can you guys joke at a time like this? Petra is still out there. She's all by herself. There's nothing funny about that. Can't just mope. Gotta keep our spirits high. No, we should be moping. That's exactly what we should be doing. Axel. I'm right, right? Maybe, but she's going to be fine. Yeah. What makes you think that? She has to be. Because Petra Fine. Then uh we should get some rest. We gotta start looking for this temple as early as we can. Now, my guess is if we start at the portal and kinda split oh, up. Oh, what are you doing? Did I do something to you? I'd really like to know, because you keep getting on my case for what seems like no reason. We'll figure it out in the morning. Maybe you're right. I'm, I'm pretty exhausted. Jesse means us, not you. Axel, we'll figure it out in the morning. You're the only one wearing that stupid jacket. Don't tell us what to do. Take that back. Can't. Wouldn't. You know what? I get to wear this jacket because I know how to build. But that doesn't mean I don't know how to break things. Your threats don't scare me now that we know how you really are. Jesse, what your friend is way out of line. I wasn't going to bring it up, but I can only take so much. Let's just drop it. Don't be like that, Jesse. Just drop it. Haven't you done enough damage for one day? Petra might be dead because of you. You're taking this too far, Axel. Mm -hmm. I don't have to take this. Listen, why don't I just leave and let you guys hash this out? You can't leave. It's dangerous out there. I can take care of myself. It's what Axel wants, right? Let him leave if he wants to leave. You're not going anywhere. But Jesse... That's enough. We're all on the same team now. He's staying. Ah, well, my thought you would. Zombie-sized chickens. That's what I would fight. Why is that? Because I'm starving. Of course. You okay? It was a rough night. It happens. We were all tired, and I'm just glad you're okay. Thanks for being so cool about it. Cool beans. Hey! There's something over that way. What is it? Some kind of building, I think. Let's get a closer look. This has to be the place. What is this place? That's what we're trying to figure out. It's the Temple of the Order of the Stone. Lucas, are you sure? He's right. Look. Oh. Holy crap. Do you think they're in there? Let's go in and find out. Let's just all be careful. Okay. If you spot anything, call it out. We don't have a lot of time. Isn't it weird how dispensers are carved to look like spooky little faces? What do you dispense, little guy? I get the feeling that we don't really want to find out. Get behind me. Spider. Huh? Ah, what was that? That's probably not a good thing. Oh, come on, dispenser faces. I thought we were friends. Run! We're trapped! 
We activated the dispensers with that pressure plate. If we can figure out a way to trigger it again, I bet that'll shut them off. There's a crafting table. Maybe we can make something useful. Out of what? We don't have anything. All of our tools and materials are back home. All right, everyone, empty your pockets. Let's see what we've got to work with. I have a few sticks left over from building the shelter last night. I've got some flint and a piece of string. All I have are some chicken feathers I picked up after that chicken machine exploded. Well, let's see, I've got some flint and steel, a sword. Oh, and some string from a spider that I fought in the woods earlier. String, sticks, flint, and feathers. Do this. Nice. All right. The dead ender's luck is changing. Shoka. And Lucas had to do a fight at West. This must be their enchantment room. Doesn't this look like Ivor's creepy basement? Find anything useful? Not sure about useful, but definitely interesting. There is a lot of history in this room. Book. The battle was fierce. But the Order of the Stone emerged triumphant, saving the land and ensuring that peace and prosperity would reign forever. Well, not exactly forever. These five members, five friends, together would give so much to gain their rightful place as five heroes. They would author their own end. They would slay a dragon. Ivor was a member of the Order of the Stone? The stories never mentioned him. This is so crazy. It's like they erased him. There must be a reason he's never been mentioned. They cut him out of the story. They lied to us. I don't understand why they would do that. Man, I can't believe you punched a member of the Order of the Stone. <laughs> this is so crazy. The Order might not be what we thought they were, but Petra is still out there. That monster is still out there. Jesse's right. We need to focus on what we came here to do. Where do these stairs go? They go up. <laughs> Definitely they go up. Now this is cool. Wow. What happened to the walls? More like what happened to this whole place. This must have been where they met. So where are they then? Gabriel said that once we find the temple, the amulet would lead us to the Order of the Stone. Well, what are you waiting for? Pull it out then. Is something supposed to happen? Well, no, that was a letdown. There's got to be something we're missing. Look around and see if you can find anything. Okay. It's a map of the entire world. Like this is way nicer than the one at Endercon. 
جہاں کھا رہا ہوں مجھے خود بھی نہیں پتا We're in the temple of the Order of the Stone. The Order's actual temple. Who'd have thought it, huh? A bunch of small towners like us wrapped up in an adventure like this. Yeah, it's pretty insane. I just hope we all come out the other side in one piece. Yeah, he'll be about to leave anything. Man, I'm... Absolutely incredible! How did they build this? Okay, now I'm impressed. This looks like some sort of tracking system. Yeah. It's the order. It's showing where they are right now. Look, we don't know enough about how this thing works. Maybe the amulet only tracks them when they're on the surface. Or maybe it doesn't work when they're in the nether. We have to go off what we do know. There are only two lights on that map. If there are only two heroes left, then we know what we need to do. Petra's relying on us. That Witherstorm is still out there. We know that Gabriel was trying to tell us something. We've got to find the Order of the Stone. But there are only two lights. There are only two members of the Order left? He said Soren was missing. That leaves Magnus. Or Eligard. Okay. Well, let's head out. I'm not going with you guys. I have to stay here. Thank you. If I know Petra, she's probably doing everything she can to find this place. She's still out there. She has to be. We might need your help out there. You should come with us. No. You don't need me. This is where I should be. If there's even a small chance she's alive, I have to stay. Go. Get help. I'm gonna focus on making this place safe before nightfall. This temple is pretty big, though. If we're gonna have a chance at fortifying it, I'm gonna need some help. If, uh, maybe one of you guys can hang back with me? Sounds like Olivia will have you totally covered while me and Jesse are out finding Magnus. Finding Magnus? You really think that's how it's going to go? We need Eligard. She's the world's greatest engineer. She'll figure out a way to stop that thing. We're trying to destroy it. And when it comes to destruction, Magnus is the master. You're a smart person, Jesse. And obviously, the smart thing to do is to go get Magnus. I... <laughs> think Axel meant Eligard there, Jesse. Uh, no. I don't think I did. Pretty sure Axel meant Magnus. Jesse, the point is, you should be going to Eligard's. It's the clear choice to make. You've got to come with me. You're my best friend, Jesse. It's you and me. Like always. Think about it, Jesse. This is more of a gut call. We need to make sure we get this right. Oh We're not going to get a second shot at this. Whatever decision you make, I'll be cool with it. Really? As long as it's me. Come on, Jesse. This is an easy call. No, it's not. To her best friend, Emily. He said he will be cool if I choose anything. Olivia, you and I are going to Eligard's. Awesome. Axel, you stay here with Lucas and get the place ready for when Petra shows up. What, with that guy? I'm right here. Come on, Axel. <laughs> for Petra's sake. Fine, I'll do it. Guys? Please hurry. Yeah, we should. 
next time on Story Mode. Jesse and Olivia return to the Nether, intent on finding Eligard, the Redstone Engineer. And find themselves in a place of mechanical marvels, redstone rarities. Amazing machines, limited only by the imagination of their brilliant creator. While the great storm grows, consuming everything in its wake, time is running out for our intrepid heroes. I made most of the choices right. Nice. Oh, that's mosques. Great. The episode one was great. So, hope guys, you enjoyed the video. The episode one was really great. I love. I'm beginning to love this game. Like Minecraft. I I never knew this game will be so great. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, leave a like and comment below if you want another episode. I'm really, I'm really into this game, I, I will definitely do episode 2, but I hope you have guys have subscribed my channel and do check out my uh, other vlog channel also. I will see you guys in the next video and don't forget to hit the bell, bye bye.